Coach Simpson, Eastern Guilford Middle School Wildcats. Coach, a big win, 8-6, hard-earned win, but you got to be proud of your guys to get that victory here today. Yes, sir, we are proud of them. Um, started off the season 0-2, playing two tough opponents, but right now we're 2-0 in conference, and we just got to keep plugging along. And they tell me you guys are trying to go for that third straight conference title. You want that? Yes, sir, we want it. Um, <laughs> not having the year last year uh, put us behind the eight ball a little bit, but these guys know we got a tradition, and we're trying to continue it on. And talk about what you guys did right today. What did you do right in this game? Um, I think we just played to the end. We got a lot of guys going both ways, and it is hard. Um, and they're giving me everything they got. Uh, we made a few mental mistakes as mistakes as a coach myself that uh, kind of put us in that hole. But I just like to fight my guys. And if we can keep fighting from start to finish, I'm proud win or lose. Got to be real proud of that defense there at the end, though, right? Yeah, I told them. Uh, Extra point is really the most important play, especially in middle school. Uh, we won last week by converting the extra point and keeping the other team from scoring, and we did it tonight. Um, stopping them on the extra point after the bad snap that gave them great field position, told them we got an extra point, we got to stop it, and we did. And you also were kind of playing defense and offense late in the game, too, trying to keep that uh, play clock going, eat yes, that time sir. up, and yeah. use all the time between Tried plays you could. To, yes, with, uh, with our guys, I know they're fatigued and tired, so we want to use every ounce of that 40-second, 25-second clock we can. And luckily, we kept moving the chains and kept running the clock. We talk about uh, Trent slash Trent and Horton, the job <laughs> that seventh grader did today for you. Uh, he's a wonderful young man. Um, he is being a leader as a seventh grader, so we expect him to do great things and carry on the tradition here with um, excellent players going on to the high school. And he, he worked hard today. He also took some pretty hard shots out there, too. He paid the price for what he got. He did, and he 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 gets hit every game. He gets hit every game, and I try to tell our linemen that, you know, he's he's going hard every play, so y'all got to do it for him. He's getting beat up. He's not complaining. He's getting back up, running the next play. So, hey, do it for him, man. He's a he's a tough player. The big Samari back there, the big number 30, the big back, he's running hard, too, for you. Very, very hard. We uh, Actually, we had an injury to our starting running back, and we put him in the last two weeks, and he's just getting better each and every game, running hard. Uh, running hard, so we're very proud of him, and he's going to keep getting better with the more work he's getting in practice. What's it going to take to have this team, make this team keep getting better? They, we just got to keep putting in the work. You know, sometimes with this group of guys, um, they get complacent, or we, you know, we just... We just got to keep pushing them, and they got to keep pushing themselves and each other, but not only on the football field, but they got to do it in the classroom as well. I think if we can uh, just stay together as a team and keep working forward, then we can get our third championship. You feel like that third straight conference championship is within your reach? It's definitely within our reach, but I know that every game is going to be a battle. Every game is going to be a battle. Uh, we knew that going in. Um, we scheduled some very non tough non-conference games, and we took our lumps in the beginning, but with the goal that we want to be ready for conference and get that third straight conference championship. Coach, big win today over Kyle's. You beat the Tigers. Wildcats move on the victory, and uh, as you close things out, how about close us with that signature close? Give me a couple of hey-hey's. <laughs> oh, you keep getting me on that. Hey, hey, hey.